Right now in federal court, a woman police say was involved in the brutal murder of Vanessa Guillen is set to go before a judge at this hour in Waco. Cecily Aguilar charged with conspiracy to tamper with evidence. Investigators believe Aguilar helped the murder suspect, Aaron Robinson, to dismember and burn Guillen's remains after she was killed at Fort Hood. Channel 2's Brittany Jeffers has been following the details of this case. Now she joins us live with the push by Vanessa's family and the community to make sure there's justice. Brittany? Yeah, all morning long, we've seen people stopping by this mural here behind me. You can still see the candles burning uh, in honor of Vanessa Guillen. People stopping by all day long, some who knew her, some who didn't. I spoke with one woman who says she knew her since she was a little girl. She calls her independent and strong, and she says she wants justice. Sad, very sad. Sonia Reyes says she can still see Vanessa Guillen running up and down the hallways of Mr. Cole's antique flea market and later working here at a Tancaria stand. She was like very determined. She knew what she wanted and she did what she had to do to get it. She vividly remembers her laughing at this table. Vanessa's sister worked for Reyes. She says the girls were like family. She says she supported Vanessa's dream to join the army. One said, baby, follow your dream. You have what it takes. Go and if you want to serve your country, serve your country. When she disappeared in April, she helped hang these posters in the hallway that Vanessa once filled with joy. She says when she found out over the weekend that the Army had identified Vanessa's remains, she says she felt an overwhelming grief. I cannot describe how the, the huge loss that Vanessa means to all of us, to her family, to her country, to all of us. The girl had a lot of potential. So again, that alleged accomplice will be in federal court later this morning. Live here in Southeast Houston, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News.